Hi, I'm Christy Johnston from Center for Holistic Healing and Art, and I've just finished hanging my art show, Interpretations of Ireland, and I'm going to give you a tour. I'm here at the Irish Cultural Center in Canton, Massachusetts, where there's going to be a big Irish festival this weekend for St. Patrick's Day. So I'm going to turn us around so you can see what's going on. All right. So I've got this little corner to myself. All my artwork up there, nice big piece in the corner, and then the rest of them over there. So I'm gonna come back, and I'm gonna give you the up close tour. So this one is Irish Welcome, and I'll go in close. You can see that pretty blue door back there. Nice little path. That one is sold. This is Afternoon Glow, lots of great texture in there. That one is also sold. Now here's one that's available. This is Hay Bales, or I came up with, uh, I hope I'm gonna say it right, Burlai Fair, which is Bales of Hay. So that one is available for 250. And then up here, we've got the Bruna Boyne, which means bend in the Boyne. This is the Boyne River. And all these great cows that down to have a drink. That one is available. That is 385. That is a generous size piece. It's about a little more than 16 by 20. Then we have Ben Bobin, which is sold. It's an iconic place in Sligo. Everybody who knows Sligo knows the Ben Bobin Mountain. And then we have Amble Down. This has a great potbelly stove that's resting on a stone or rock. Um, this was a little restaurant that we went to a couple times because it was so tasty. That is available for 185. We have this called Weathered Beauty. Let me get in there so you can see that great door and all that fun texture. I had such fun with that one. That one is available. That is 270. That's actual Weathered Beauty 2. It's a pretty decent size. We have this called Scarlet and Green Entry with this great crusty gate and lovely flowing curvy ivy. Some impatience and some, hmm, I don't know, some other flowers. Here we go, we've got this uh, one called Rising Tide, and you see um, Ben Bulbin in the distance up here. That's that mountain I showed you already. And that is the Atlantic Ocean on the other side of where we are now. Very rough, very intense surf. It's called the Wild Atlantic Ray Way by Yeats. And then down here, oh, that one's sold, by the way. This is Bucolic Afternoon, this is available. This is 245. And this has lovely shadows, some ripening apples, and that great rusty gate. In the very far back, you can see some flowers climbing up that tree. We have Blissful Boa, a lovely, lovely little island, windswept. This is available. This is 245. Zoom out so you can kind of get a sense of it. Here we have Classy Bond Castle with those great sheep. I'm going to zoom in so you can see the texture on those stones and the way they cut in. And the sheep, black faced sheep. And there's the castle. Sorry for the reflections. And then we have, going on, we're moving right along here. We've got Wind Weathered. This is the other side of the bay, and this is sold. The bay there, Sligo, where I had the other waves, that's just the other direction. This is available, this is called Storm at Mullockmore, and this actually connects to the castle. So in real life, this was the road to the castle, and the castle is over there somewhere, so I have it positioned this way. Okay, up here we've got um, Rocks and Blooms. This one is sold, but I want you to see the texture on those rocks. I really got a lot of 3D effect on that. Everybody likes that one. 
and then we have this is available this is called morning visit and that is a working barn and that door actually allows the farmers to throw the hay bales out that are stored in there that one's available for 185 I'm gonna go up here so you can see this is called Irish quilt see if I can get an angle that doesn't make it reflective I'm gonna get Getting close, you can see the details there. Sheep in the upper fields, cows in the lower fields. Just beginning to turn into autumn. Some beautiful light on those bushes and sheep in that near field. And can you see the gate there? See the gate in the passage there. Just a lot of fun detail in this one. And that is available, that is 385 a bargain. It's a big piece. Um, but I want someone who loves it to be able to take it home. And here is an Eskelin stone. It's got some sheep up there, all these great craggy rocks, and some beautiful clematis or clematis, depends on how you say it, climbing up inside of there, making itself at home. That one's available for $2.75. Go over here. This is She Persisted, and it is available for $2.55. This is a lovely little stone building with a thriving red rose bush, despite the fact that the weather is very harsh. Both the building and the rose are thriving. That's why I named it She Persisted. And we have this sweet little one. This is the original Weathered Beauty. That is the same as Weathered Beauty 2, but from a different direction. This is straight on. This is small, but it has a lot of great detail and texture. This is available for 185. And then here we have many people's favorite. You see those pigeons in there? This is called Ivy Hideaway, and it is available for 285. It's gotten a lot of interest, so if this is something that appeals to you and you're not able to make it, please shoot me a message, a text, Christy at, and that's K-R-I-S-T-I, um, holistic healing and art .com, holistic with an H. This is grazing in the green 265. It's got the two little stone buildings. I'll get in close. You can see that one. Isn't that fun? And all of those different cows and sheep up there. More cows, another little stone building. Had a lot of fun with that. As you can see, I love detail. And last but never least, on more Oat. Probably butchering it up, but good luck to you. And what's more lucky than an Irish rainbow? So that's it. This one is also available 255. And Grazing in the Green is 265 if you're interested in that. Thanks for joining me.